In celestial mechanics, an orbital resonance occurs when orbiting bodies exert a regular, periodic gravitational influence on each other, usually because their orbital periods are related by a ratio of small integers. Most commonly this relationship is found for a pair of objects. The physics principle behind orbital resonance is similar in concept to pushing a child on a swing, where the orbit and the swing both have a natural frequency, and the other body doing the pushing will act in periodic repetition to have a cumulative effect on the motion. Orbital resonances greatly enhance the mutual gravitational influence of the bodies, i.e. their ability to alter or constrain each other's orbits. In most cases, this results in an unstable interaction, in which the bodies exchange momentum and shift orbits until the resonance no longer exists. Under some circumstances, a resonant system can be stable and self-correcting, so that the bodies remain in resonance. Examples are the 1, 2-4 resonance of Jupiter's moons Ganymede, Europa and Io, and the 2-3 resonance between Pluto and Neptune. Unstable resonances with Saturn's inner moons give rise to gaps in the rings of Saturn. The special case of 1-1 resonance between bodies with similar orbital radii causes large solar system bodies to eject most other bodies sharing their orbits. This is part of the much more extensive process of clearing the neighborhood, an effect that is used in the current definition of a planet. A binary resonance ratio in this article should be interpreted as the ratio of number of orbits completed in the same time interval, rather than as the ratio of orbital periods, which would be the inverse ratio. Thus the 2 to 3 ratio above means Pluto completes two orbits in the time it takes Neptune to complete three. In the case of resonance relationships among three or more bodies, either type of ratio may be used in such cases the smallest whole integer ratio sequences are not necessarily reversals of each other and the type of ratio will be specified. History Since the discovery of Newton's law of universal gravitation in the 17th century, the stability of the solar system has preoccupied many mathematicians, starting with Laplace. The stable orbits that arise in a two-body approximation ignore the influence of other bodies. The effect of these added interactions on the stability of the solar system is very small, but at first it was not known whether they might add up over longer periods to significantly change the orbital parameters and lead to a completely different configuration, or whether some other stabilizing effects might maintain the configuration of the orbits of the planets. It was Laplace who found the first answers explaining the linked orbits of the Galilean moons see below. Before Newton, there was also consideration of ratios and proportions in orbital motions, in what was called the music of the spheres, or musica universalis. <laughs> Topic. Types of resonance In general, an orbital resonance may Involve one or any combination of the orbit parameters e.g. eccentricity versus semi-major axis, or eccentricity versus orbital inclination Act on any time scale from short-term, commensurable with the orbit periods, to secular, measured in 104 to 106 years Lead to either long-term stabilization of the orbits or be the cause of their destabilization. A mean motion orbital resonance occurs when two bodies have periods of revolution that are a simple integer ratio of each other. Depending on the details, this can either stabilize or destabilize the orbit. Stabilization may occur when the two bodies move in such a synchronized fashion that they never closely approach. For instance, the orbits of Pluto and the Platinos are stable, despite crossing that of the much larger Neptune, because they are in a 2-3 resonance with it. The resonance ensures that, when they approach perihelion and Neptune's orbit, Neptune is consistently distant, averaging a quarter of its orbit away. Other much more numerous Neptune crossing bodies that were not in resonance were ejected from that region by strong perturbations due to Neptune. There are also smaller but significant groups of resonant trans-Neptunian objects occupying the 1 to 1 Neptune Trojans, 3 to 5, 4 to 7, 1 to 2 Twitinos, and 2 to 5 resonances among others with respect to Neptune. In the asteroid belt beyond 3.5 astronomical units from the Sun, the 3-2, 4-3 and 1-1 resonances with Jupiter are populated by clumps of asteroids the Hilda family, the few Thule asteroids, and the numerous Trojan asteroids, respectively. Orbital resonances can also destabilize one of the orbits. This process can be exploited to find energy-efficient ways of deorbiting spacecraft. 
For small bodies, destabilization is actually far more likely. For instance, in the asteroid belt within 3.5 astronomical units from the Sun, the major mean motion resonances with Jupiter are locations of gaps in the asteroid distribution, the Kirkwood gaps most notably at the 4 to 1, 3 to 1, 5 to 2, 7 to 3 and 2 to 1 resonances. Asteroids have been ejected from these almost empty lanes by repeated perturbations. However, there are still populations of asteroids temporarily present in or near these resonances. For example, asteroids of the Alinda family are in or close to the 3 to 1 resonance, with their orbital eccentricity steadily increased by interactions with Jupiter until they eventually have a close encounter with an inner planet that ejects them from the resonance. In the rings of Saturn, the Cassini division is a gap between the inner B ring and the outer A ring that has been cleared by a 2 to 1 resonance with the moon Mimas. More specifically, the site of the resonance is the Huygens gap, which bounds the outer edge of the B ring. In the rings of Saturn, the Ankh and Keeler gaps within the A-ring are cleared by 1 to 1 resonances with the embedded moonlets Pan and Daphnis, respectively. The A-ring's outer edge is maintained by a destabilizing 7 to 6 resonance with the moon Janus. Most bodies that are in resonance orbit in the same direction. However, the retrograde asteroid 2015 BZ509 appears to be in a stable for a period of at least a million years, 1 minus 1 resonance with Jupiter. In addition, a few retrograde damocloids have been found that are temporarily captured in mean motion resonance with Jupiter or Saturn. Such orbital interactions are weaker than the corresponding interactions between bodies orbiting in the same direction. A Laplace resonance is a three-body resonance with a 1, 2 to 4 orbital period ratio equivalent to a 4, 2 to 1 ratio of orbits. The term arose because Pierre-Simon Laplace discovered that such a resonance governed the motions of Jupiter's moons Io, Europa, and Ganymede. It is now also often applied to other three-body resonances with the same ratios, such as that between the extrasolar planets Gliese 876 c, b, and e. Three-body resonances involving other simple integer ratios have been termed Laplace-like or Laplace-type. A Lindblad resonance drives spiral density waves both in galaxies where stars are subject to forcing by the spiral arms themselves and in Saturn's rings where ring particles are subject to forcing by Saturn's moons. A secular resonance occurs when the precession of two orbits is synchronized usually a precession of the perihelion or ascending node. A small body in secular resonance with a much larger one e a planet will precess at the same rate as the large body. Over long times, a million years or so, a secular resonance will change the eccentricity and inclination of the small body. Several prominent examples of secular resonance involve Saturn. A resonance between the precession of Saturn's rotational axis and that of Neptune's orbital axis, both of which have periods of about 1.87 million years, has been identified as the likely source of Saturn's large axial tilt, 26.7 degrees. Initially, Saturn probably had a tilt closer to that of Jupiter 3.1 degrees. The gradual depletion of the Kuiper belt would have decreased the precession rate of Neptune's orbit. Eventually, the frequencies matched, and Saturn's axial precession was captured into the spin-orbit resonance, leading to an increase in Saturn's obliquity. The angular momentum of Neptune's orbit is 104 times that of Saturn's spin, and thus dominates the interaction. The perihelion secular resonance between asteroids and Saturn nu6 equals g minus g6 helps shape the asteroid belt the subscript 6 identifies Saturn as the sixth planet from the sun asteroids which approach it have their eccentricity slowly increased until they become Mars crossers at which point they are usually ejected from the asteroid belt by a close pass to Mars this resonance forms the inner and side Boundaries of the asteroid belt around two astronomical units, and at inclinations of about 20 degrees. Numerical simulations have suggested that the eventual formation of a perihelion secular resonance between Mercury and Jupiter G1 equals G5 has the potential to greatly increase Mercury's eccentricity and possibly destabilize the inner solar system several billion years from now. The Titan ringlet within Saturn's C ring represents another type of resonance in which the rate of apsidal precession of one orbit exactly matches the speed of revolution of another. The outer end of this eccentric ringlet always points towards Saturn's major moon Titan. A cosi resonance occurs when the inclination and eccentricity of a perturbed orbit oscillate synchronously, increasing eccentricity while decreasing inclination and vice versa. 
This resonance applies only to bodies on highly inclined orbits, as a consequence, such orbits tend to be unstable, since the growing eccentricity would result in small paracenters, typically leading to a collision or for large moons, destruction by tidal forces. In an example of another type of resonance involving orbital eccentricity, the eccentricities of Ganymede and Callisto vary with a common period of 181 years, although with opposite phases. Topic. Mean motion resonances in the Solar System There are only a few known mean motion resonances in the Solar System involving planets, dwarf planets or larger satellites a much greater number involve asteroids, planetary rings, moonlets and smaller Kuiper belt objects, including many possible dwarf planets 2–3 Pluto–Neptune also Orcus and other Platinos 2–4 Tethys Mimas Saturn's moons. Not simplified, because the libration of the nodes must be taken into account. 1 to 2 Dione Enceladus, Saturn's moons. 3 to 4 Hyperion Titan, Saturn's moons. 1 2 to 4 Ganymede Europa Io, Jupiter's moons. Ratio of orbits. Additionally, Haumea is believed to be in a 712 resonance with Neptune, and 225088-20070R10 is believed to be in a 310 resonance with Neptune. The simple integer ratios between periods hide more complex relations. The point of conjunction can oscillate, librate around an equilibrium point defined by the resonance. Given non-zero eccentricities, the nodes or periapsides can drift a resonance-related, short period, not secular precession. As illustration of the latter, consider the well-known 2-to-1 resonance of Io Europa. If the orbiting periods were in this relation, the mean motions n n inverse of periods, often expressed in degrees per day, would satisfy the following n i o Minus two N E U equals zero Display style N underscore erm I O minus two C D O T N underscore erm E U equals zero Substituting the data from Wikipedia, one will get minus zero point seven three nine five degrees day minus one, a value substantially different from zero. Actually, the resonance is perfect, but it involves also the precession of perigeot, the point closest to Jupiter. Omega. Display style dot omega. The correct equation, part of the Laplace equations, is n i o minus two n e u plus omega i O equals zero. Display style n underscore erm i o minus two c d o t n underscore erm e u plus dot omega underscore erm i o equals zero. In other words, the mean motion of i o is indeed double of that of Europa, taking into account the precession of the perigee. An observer sitting on the drifting perigee will see the moons coming into conjunction in the same place. Elongation. The other pairs listed above satisfy the same type of equation with the exception of Mimas Tethys resonance. In this case, the resonance satisfies the equation 4 n t e minus 2 n m i minus omega t e minus omega M I equals zero. Display style four C D O T N underscore erm T minus two C D O T N underscore erm me dot omega underscore erm T dot omega underscore erm me equals zero. The point of conjunctions librates around the midpoint between the nodes of the two moons. Topic Laplace resonance. The Laplace resonance involving Io Europa Ganymede includes the following relation locking the orbital phase of the moons. Phi L equals Lambda I O minus three Lambda E U plus 
2 lambda g a equals 180 display style phi underscore l equals lambda underscore erm i o minus 3 c d o t lambda underscore erm e u plus 2 c d o t lambda underscore erm ga equals 180 caret circ where lambda display style lambda are mean longitudes of the moons the second equals sign ignores libration this relation makes a triple conjunction impossible. A Laplace resonance in the Gliese 876 system, in contrast, is associated with one triple conjunction per orbit of the outermost planet, ignoring libration. The graph illustrates the positions of the moons after 1, 2, and 3 I.O. periods. Phi L phi underscore L librates about 180 degrees with an amplitude of 0.03 degrees. Another Laplace-like resonance involves the moon's Styx, Nix, and Hydra of Pluto. Phi equals three lambda s minus five lambda n plus two lambda h equals one hundred eighty. Display style phi equals three c d o t lambda underscore erm s minus five c d o t lambda underscore erm n plus two c d o t lambda underscore erm h equals one hundred eighty caret circ. This reflects orbital periods for Styx, Nix, and Hydra, respectively, that are close to a ratio of 18 hours 22 minutes and 33 seconds, or, in terms of the near resonances with Charon's period, 3 plus 3 elevenths, 4 to 6. See below. The respective ratio of orbits is 11, 9 to 6. Based on the ratios of synodic periods, there are five conjunctions of Styx and Hydra and three conjunctions of Nix and Hydra for every two conjunctions of Styx and Nix. As with the Galilean satellite resonance, triple conjunctions are forbidden. Phi display style phi librates about 180 degrees with an amplitude of at least 10 degrees. Topic: <laughs> Platino resonances. The dwarf planet Pluto is following an orbit trapped in a web of resonances with Neptune. The resonances include a mean motion resonance of 2 to 3 the resonance of the perihelion libration around 90 degrees keeping the perihelion above the ecliptic the resonance of the longitude of the perihelion in relation to that of neptune one consequence of these resonances is that a separation of at least 30 astronomical units is maintained when pluto crosses neptune's orbit the minimum separation between the two bodies overall is 17 astronomical units, while the minimum separation between Pluto and Uranus is just 11 astronomical units. See Pluto's orbit for detailed explanation and graphs. The next largest body in a similar 2 to 3 resonance with Neptune, called a Platino, is the probable dwarf planet Orcus. Orcus has an orbit similar in inclination and eccentricity to Pluto's. However, the two are constrained by their mutual resonance with Neptune to always be in opposite phases of their orbits. Orcus is thus sometimes described as the anti Pluto. Topic. Mean motion resonances among extrasolar planets While most extrasolar planetary systems discovered have not been found to have planets in mean motion resonances, chains of up to five resonant planets and up to seven at least near resonant planets have been uncovered. Simulations have shown that during planetary system formation, the appearance of resonant chains of planetary embryos is favored by the presence of the primordial gas disk. Once that gas dissipates, 90-95% of those chains must then become unstable to match the low frequency of resonant chains observed. As mentioned above, Gliese 876 E, B and C are in a Laplace resonance, with a 4, 2 to 1 ratio of periods 124.3, 61.1 and 30.0 days. In this case, phi L librates with an amplitude of 40 degrees plus or minus 13 degrees and the resonance follows the time average relation. Phi L equals lambda c minus 3 lambda d 
plus two lambda e equals zero display style phi underscore l equals lambda underscore erm c minus three c d o t lambda underscore erm d plus two c d o t lambda underscore erm e equals zero caret circ Kepler 223 has four planets in a resonance with an 8 to 6, 4 to 3 orbit ratio, and a 3 to 4, 6 to 8 ratio of periods 7.3845, 9.8456, 14.7887, and 19.7257 days. This represents the first confirmed four body orbital resonance. The librations within this system are such that close encounters between two planets occur only when the other planets are in distant parts of their orbits. Simulations indicate that this system of resonances must have formed via planetary migration. Kepler 80d, e, b, c and g have periods in a approximately 1.000, 1 1.512, 2.296, 3.19, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 3.1201, 
16% of systems found by the transit method are reported to have an example of this with period ratios in the range 1.83 to 2.18 as well as one sixth of planetary systems characterized by Doppler spectroscopy with in this case a narrower period ratio range. Due to incomplete knowledge of the systems, the actual proportions are likely to be higher. Overall, about a third of radial velocity characterized systems appear to have a pair of planets close to a commensurability. It is much more common for pairs of planets to have orbital period ratios a few percent larger than a mean motion resonance ratio than a few percent smaller particularly in the case of first-order resonances, in which the integers in the ratio differ by one. This was predicted to be true in cases where tidal interactions with the star are significant. Topic. Coincidental near ratios of mean motion A number of near-integer ratio relationships between the orbital frequencies of the planets or major moons are sometimes pointed out see list below. However, these have no dynamical significance because there is no appropriate precession of perihelion or other libration to make the resonance perfect see the detailed discussion in the section above. Such near resonances are dynamically insignificant even if the mismatch is quite small because, unlike a true resonance, after each cycle the relative position of the bodies shifts. When averaged over astronomically short timescales, their relative position is random, just like bodies that are nowhere near resonance. For example, consider the orbits of Earth and Venus, which arrive at almost the same configuration after 8 Earth orbits and 13 Venus orbits. The actual ratio is 0.6151862424, which is only 0.032% away from exactly 813. The mismatch after 8 years is only 1.5 degrees of Venus's orbital movement. Still, this is enough that Venus and Earth find themselves in the opposite relative orientation to the original every 120 such cycles, which is 960 years. Therefore, on timescales of thousands of years or more still tiny by astronomical standards, their relative position is effectively random. The presence of a near resonance may reflect that a perfect resonance existed in the past, or that the system is evolving towards one in the future. Some orbital frequency coincidences include the least probable orbital correlation in the list is that between Io and Métis, followed by those between Rosalind and Cordelia, Pallas and Ceres, Jupiter and Pallas, Callisto and Ganymede, and Hydra and Charon, respectively. Topic. Possible past mean motion resonances A past resonance between Jupiter and Saturn may have played a dramatic role in early solar system history. A 2004 computer model by Alessandro Morbidelli of the Observatoire de la Côte d'Azur in Nice suggested that the formation of a 1-2 resonance between Jupiter and Saturn due to interactions with planetesimals that caused them to migrate inward and outward, respectively created a gravitational push that propelled both Uranus and Neptune into higher orbits, and in some scenarios caused them to switch places, which would have doubled Neptune's distance from the Sun. The resultant expulsion of objects from the Proto-Kuiper belt as Neptune moved outwards could explain the late heavy bombardment 600 million years after the solar system's formation and the origin of Jupiter's Trojan asteroids. An outward migration of Neptune could also explain the current occupancy of some of its resonances particularly the 2-5 resonance within the Kuiper belt. While Saturn's mid-sized moons Dione and Tethys are not close to an exact resonance now, they may have been in a 2-3 resonance early in the solar system's history. This would have led to orbital eccentricity and tidal heating that may have warmed Tethys' interior enough to form a subsurface ocean. Subsequent freezing of the ocean after the moons escaped from the resonance may have generated the extensional stresses that created the enormous Graben system of Ithaca Chasma on Tethys. The satellite system of Uranus is notably different from those of Jupiter and Saturn in that it lacks precise resonances among the larger moons, while the majority of the larger moons of Jupiter, three of the four largest, and of Saturn, six of the eight largest, are in mean motion resonances. In all three satellite systems, moons were likely captured into mean motion resonances in the past as their orbits shifted due to tidal dissipation a process by which satellites gain orbital energy at the expense of the primary's rotational energy, affecting inner moons disproportionately. In the Uranian system, however, due to the planet's lesser degree of oblateness, and the larger relative size of its satellites, escape from a mean motion resonance is much easier. 
lower oblateness of the primary alters its gravitational field in such a way that different possible resonances are spaced more closely together. A larger relative satellite size increases the strength of their interactions. Both factors lead to more chaotic orbital behavior at or near mean motion resonances. Escape from a resonance may be associated with capture into a secondary resonance, and or tidal evolution driven increases in orbital eccentricity or inclination. Mean motion resonances that probably once existed in the Uranus system include 3 to 5 aerial Miranda, 1 to 3 umbrial Miranda, 3 to 5 umbrial aerial, and 1 to 4 Titania aerial. Evidence for such past resonances includes the relatively high eccentricities of the orbits of Uranus's inner satellites, and the anomalously high orbital inclination of Miranda. High past orbital eccentricities associated with the 1 to 3 umbrial Miranda and 1 to 4 Titania aerial resonances may have led to tidal heating of the interiors of Miranda and Ariel, respectively. Miranda probably escaped from its resonance with Umbriel via a secondary resonance, and the mechanism of this escape is believed to explain why its orbital inclination is more than ten times those of the other regular Uranian moons. See Uranus's natural satellites. Similar to the case of Miranda, the present inclinations of Jupiter's moonlets Amalthea and Tebe are thought to be indications of past passage through the 3 to 1 and 4 to 2 resonances with Io, respectively. Neptune's regular moons Proteus and Larissa are thought to have passed through a 1 2 resonance a few hundred million years ago. The moons have drifted away from each other since then because Proteus is outside a synchronous orbit and Larissa is within one. Passage through the resonance is thought to have excited both moons' eccentricities to a degree that has not since been entirely damped out. In the case of Pluto's satellites, it has been proposed that the present near resonances are relics of a previous precise resonance that was disrupted by tidal damping of the eccentricity of Charon's orbit. See Pluto's natural satellites for details. The near resonances may be maintained by a 15% local fluctuation in the Pluto Charon gravitational field. Thus, these near resonances may not be coincidental. The smaller inner moon of the dwarf planet Haumea, Namaka, is one-tenth the mass of the larger outer moon, Hiyaka. Namaka revolves around Haumea in 18 days in an eccentric, non-Keplerian orbit, and as of 2008 is inclined 13 degrees from Hiyaka. Over the timescale of the system, it should have been tidally damped into a more circular orbit. It appears that it has been disturbed by resonances with the more massive Hiyaka, due to converging orbits as it moved outward from Haumea because of tidal dissipation. The moons may have been caught in and then escaped from orbital resonance several times. They probably passed through the 3-1 resonance relatively recently, and currently are in or at least close to an 8-3 resonance. Namaka's orbit is strongly perturbed, with a current precession of about minus 6.5 degrees per year. Topic. See also 1685 Toro, an asteroid in 5 to 8 resonance with the Earth, 3753 Kruthni, an asteroid in 1 to 1 resonance with the Earth, Commensurability, astronomy. Dermot's Law, Horseshoe orbit, followed by an object in another type of 1 to 1 resonance, Kozai resonance, Lagrangian points. Mercury, which has a 3 to 2 spin orbit resonance. Musica Universalis, music of the spheres. Resonant trans-Neptunian object. Tidal locking. Tidal resonance. Titius Bode law. Trojan object, a body in a type of 1 to 1 resonance. Arnold tongue. Transfer operator. Topic. References. Murray, C. D., Dermot, S. F. 1999. Solar System Dynamics. Cambridge University Press. ISBN 0-521-57597-4. Malhotra, Renu, Hallman, Matthew, Ito, Takashi Orbital Resonances and Chaos in the Solar System. PDF. PNAS, Solar System Formation and Evolution. 98 22 12342 12343 DOI 10.1073 PNAS.2313840098 Malhotra, Renu 1995 The Origin of Pluto's Orbit Implications for the Solar System Beyond Neptune 
The Astronomical Journal, 110 to 420. Archive, Astro PH, 9504036. Bibcode, 1995AJ. 0.110420M. doi, 10.1086, 117532. Lemaitre, A. 2010. Resonances, Models and Captures. In Suchet, J. Dvorak, R. Dynamics of Small Solar System Bodies and Exoplanets. Lecture Notes in Physics, 790. Springer. pp. 1-62. Doi 978 3 642 8 ISBN 978-3-642-04457-1. Topic: External links. Media related to orbital resonance at Wikimedia Commons.